Some Canton residents stepped back in time and up to bat today to help their neighbors. The Canton Intermediate School PTO hosted the season opener for the Hartford Senators of the New England Vintage Baseball League. Proceeds from snack sales will be given to workers who lost their jobs after last month's fire at the Inertia Dynamics Factory. Fox 61's Lori Perez was in the stand. Oh, say can you see? The uniforms are vintage. These uniforms are uh, replicas of uh, the 1923 Hartford Senators. The equipment <laughs> and rules antiquated. Six balls for a walk. Um, it's overhand pitching. Uh, the batter will call for a uh, high, high strike or low strike. But what's most on display here is a little old-fashioned thing called community. The great community and the fact that they're doing this as a fundraiser is even better. You know, it just shows a lot. It tells you a lot about this, this small town here. Something like this, I think, it kind of brings back the old values. I think it's important that stays here. When flames destroyed Inertia Dynamics, its 150 workers lost their jobs. After 30 years to organize the game, says it's a fitting way to raise money. It's kind of uh, ironic twisted. I mean, this game that you're going to see here today kind of started in the 1880s when this factory was in its incipience. And uh, how now you have baseball of 1880s versus factory in 2002 blending together. It's kind of a neat twist. The rules of baseball might have changed. The rules of life have not. It's about how we can be a world of giving and loving and, and community. And, and so this is just one tiny example of that. In Canton, Lori Perez, Fox 61 News at 10. Today's event raised a few hundred dollars to help.